In this video, I want to demonstrate how to use the video record feature within its learning. Now this is located all throughout its learning. Anytime that you're working with an item that has the rich text editor, you will see this feature. I'm going to demonstrate a few places where you can find this and how to use it. So to begin with, I'm in an its learning course. I'm in my resources tab and I'm going to add a new feature. I'm going to start with a note. So I'm going to choose note. I'll give my note a name and then notice right below the title in the text box here, you will see the rich text editor toolbar. It has multiple different features and things that you can add and use within um, that text box. But the one we're looking for is this video recording icon. When you are ready to record your video, just click that icon. It will load your webcam. When you're ready to record, just click the record button. It will count down for you and then you start recording. Say whatever you need to share with your students. It needs to be at least 10 seconds in length, but no more than 10 minutes. Once you're done recording, hit stop. It will upload that video. You will then be able to watch that video and see if you like it. If you do not like the video, you can just click the retry button. Notice over here on the left, you probably want to name that video recording. And then if everything is good, click save. It will then embed that video right there into the text box for this note. I could additionally put images or type information, whatever I want to within that text box. I can set up any other active times or anything else that I need. For that note, I'm going to just go ahead and click save. And then notice this is what the kids will see when they go to the note in your course. They will just have to hit play. And then they will be able to watch your video. They can also click here and go full screen. Now let me show you where else you can find this rich text editor toolbar. If I click here on a page that I've already created, I added a block already, but I'm going to click to edit that block. And notice once again, here's that rich text editor option. There's the video recorder. Now notice to the left of that icon, there's also an audio recording. So if you just need to read items to your students, or you just need to audibly give them directions, exact same option, just an audio recording instead of video recording. Here's an example, sam uh, example of an assignment. If I go ahead and show that, I'm going to edit it. And once again, here in the description box, if I click more options, I have the video choice here. Same thing is true on a test. I could do that on the directions of a test or actually when I add questions within a test and I add a new question for every part, whether it's the question itself or the answers, you will also see this little video recording option. Once again, that's also in your planner. It's also within um, comments. You've got multiple choices of places that you could do this. So hopefully you will find this video recording option a helpful tool for you within its learning.